Go! <laughs> Oh my god! No, oh, that was a good one. You have nothing better to do except prank your old grandma. Remember, I used to do that every day. Like I've stopped. I know. But I was like, fuck, I need I, I need a good break. one. I had a break. I know you had a good break. Hey, you call Gio up. <laughs> Hi Gio. What's up, boy? Yeah, go ahead, roll over. Go ahead. No? Yeah. 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 Belly rub. <laughs> Hi. What's going on, Grom? You playing your game? Yeah, then I'm gonna jump in the shower. You don't gotta go to any stores today, do you? No. No, thanks. So. It's the first. Yeah, I know. <laughs> got a break today. Yep. Gio's coming in here trying. What's he going under your bed? <laughs> What's up guys? How you guys doing today? So if you guys see this mark right here, you guys might have actually seen it on yesterday's vlog near the end. I don't know what happened, but yesterday when I was shaving, I noticed it. I think it might have been like an ingrown hair, and I tried picking at it, and I actually just made it worse. I gotta stop doing that. Whenever something like a pimple comes up on me, I end up picking it, and it makes it look worse. Not the smartest idea, but whatever. It'll heal. I wanted to go to the gym this morning, but Frank won't wake up right now. I called him, he woke up, and he, I think he fell back asleep. But my sister and my girlfriend Lizzie are at the gym right now. So it ends up being that it actually was an ingrown hair. I just got my tweezers and I plucked it out and it ended up being this super long hair. It was crazy how long it was. This mark should go away within a day now. So if you guys see the Nerf gun and air horn right here, my family came in my room this morning trying to prank me. They kind of failed a little bit though because I was already awake and plus I just put my covers over my head so the Nerf gun didn't even phase me. Gio, why's your pecker out? What are you doing, boy? Put that back inside. Nobody needs to see that, Gio. <laughs> Gio was just barking at me. I think he might have to go to the bathroom. Come on, Gio. Remember when we first got him, he was so scared to go down these steps. My dad's cleaning his car already. You just got it. <laughs> I washed yours, I washed oh, crap. You washed mine too. Thank you. Gio's checking out the new car. Look out. He's so curious. <laughs> <laughs> How's it look? Good. How's it back look? Yeah, it looks good. And it must have had oil or something. Yeah, there we go. He's going potty now. Good boy. Good boy. Good, yeah, the tent makes it look a lot better. Yo, see this? How that is? See how it's low in the front? That's gonna be jacked up the same. Yeah, my dad said his friend's gonna raise it for you. Same size that. That look good, huh? Yeah, make it even. <laughs> He's going inside. <laughs> Climbing in, Gio. You wanna sit? There you go, boy. He's never been in this car yet. He's curious. Oh, he spotted the other dog. He's looking out the window. So I saw this video a couple days ago where somebody had their dog inside of their car. And it was like a super fast car. And they went from like 0 to 100 super quick. And the fucking dog ended up getting like slammed into the back of the seat. And he was just like, oh, like the dog didn't know what to do. He was trying to hold on to everything he could. I don't know, it was just super funny. There's Gio and the other dog. These dogs are like lovers. Look, they're kissing. My dad wants to try and pull his truck in this garage. I don't think it's gonna fit. And if it does, it'll be so close. Where's Gio? He's right in front of me. Let me, hold on. I don't think it's gonna fit. Having, you having some difficulty? I don't think it's going to, dude. I don't know, like it, it might by just really just slim just chance though. Dude, why are you even trying to put it in? Nah, I would I wouldn't even try. <laughs> he's trying to come in. <laughs> I got off. I know. I guess he's done trying. I just asked my dad to go to the gym. He's like, ah. Uh. He used to come with me all the time. He said he's gonna start going again. But you were actually getting like slim and freaking starting to get some muscle gains on you. I mean it's not like you don't have muscle already, but he was getting toned and it actually looked really good. We gotta get back into it every day. <laughs> yeah. Me and him used to go every single day, like we were really into it. And then a lot of stuff was going on with his job, hours were changing and everything, so he didn't really have the time to go. After going outside, Gio's pooped now. <laughs> what just happened? His whole body just wolfed into the door. Really? <laughs> Gio, <laughs> you're so goofy. I just heard a loud bang, I was like, what the <laughs> hell is that? <laughs> Where'd you just go, shopping? Thought so you just went to the gym. We did, we did. Yeah, that. I went shopping. Uh -huh.
somebody sent us this GoPro mount to put on Geo the other day. I'm gonna I'm gonna put it on him right now, and then I'm gonna get that remote controlled car that we have and drive around with it and try and get Geo to chase it. I just tried for like 10 minutes to try and put this thing on Geo. He keeps squirming around and won't let me put it on him. I don't think this is gonna work out. I might have to just put the GoPro on the truck. So the harness wouldn't go on Geo. He wouldn't let me do it. So I'm gonna put the GoPro on here, but I don't know which way to do it because I feel like. Either he's gonna chase after it, or he's gonna be scared of it. I'm gonna end up chasing him. So if that happens, I'll just have to change the GoPro around. But I think I'm gonna start it off like that. Yeah, they just had their sprinklers on. They fell off again. Go get a Geo. The mailman just gave Gio a phone. It's <laughs> awesome. so cute. <laughs> <laughs> and now Cindy's out. There you go. Gio. He ran through the sprinkler. <laughs> no. No? You dog. came in this morning and got me. Not my dog. That was right on my neck. That hurt? It hurt, you asshole! You came in this morning and tried shooting me. You act like I don't have good aim. I got both of them. Grandma thought I was still downstairs. <laughs> Guys, I called Frank three hours ago and he's still in bed. He just woke up again. <laughs> Are we going to the gym? Oh, uh, give me an hour. An hour? <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. All right. I guess that RC truck wore Geo out like crazy. He's been sleeping for like the past 30 minutes. I told you guys, my mom loves cow towels. I just gave them to her. My favorite. Before we hit the gym, I'm gonna go over to the post office right now and see if we got anything there today. I don't think there's gonna be too much mail today considering I didn't get a call as well. So we're just gonna take my car and we're also gonna take Geo in my car for the first time. Your car? Yeah. <laughs> he's gonna be like this and he's gonna be like, woof, woof, woof. <laughs> uh, That was a terrible. Explanation. Yeah, I don't even know what you're trying to do. Alright, whatever. Like, he's gonna get flown back into the seat, is what I'm saying. Go for a car ride, Jake? Tell your mom we're taking him so he doesn't get- Yeah. <laughs> mom, we're taking Gio! Come All on, right. Jake! I hope she heard me. First time with Gio in my car. This'll be fun. He'll probably never want to come back in here again after this experience. He's not even phased by it. <laughs> he took that like a chip. Oh. <laughs> he can't stand. Ow, he's clawing. He's clawing you? Yeah. It's not me. <laughs> Gio is trying to bite Lizzie right now. Gio thinks that Lizzie is the one moving him like that when it's really the car. Chill out, J.L. You're a good boy. Frank just called me on FaceTime and the FaceTime cut off, but I told him we're, we're not home right now. Yo, 
Dude, why are you going to Philly? Dude, we gotta go to Philly. It's an emergency. You gotta turn. You, you gotta go home. Why? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> um, I'm I'm going to the post office real quick. Oh, all right. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be home in uh ten minutes. Yeah, it's all. All right. Are you on your way? Yeah. Okay, just go into the house. I'll be there. Bye. Yeah. Yo, guys, look at this. Frank is fucking behind me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? He caught up to me. I didn't even realize until just now. See, I told you guys he was behind me. How did... Did you just see me? You're like, fuck, I'm turning this way. I was driving to your house. I saw you pull... I saw you drive by. So I just pulled a Yui. I was like 10 cars behind you. I was like, I'm not going to find him. Oh, my like, God. Oh, I see it. That's funny. So I just told you guys that there's probably not going to be a lot of mail here today. Well, it just so happens that the mail literally just came now. They're bringing it inside, and there actually is a good amount. I think there's too much for me to fit in my car alone, so good thing Frank showed up. And we'll just throw some packages in his car, too. So these are the packages that we got today. And we probably got some mail up here, too. Oh, he's moving my seat. He just, he's moving my seat backwards. Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> Yo. So we got Frank here now. I'm going to open these packages real quick. And then me and him are going to go to the gym. I'm going to break Lizzie's new knife in for her. Frank said he has a lot of leg pain right now. You sore as fuck? My ass hurts. <laughs> From them squats? Yeah. yeah. All right, let's get this started. We're assuming that there's maybe mac and cheese or something similar in here. Jeez, it's ramen. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Hi, Lance. I decided to get Cody a new wig. Th that has nothing to do with the ramen. Is it underneath it? No. Oh, that's weird. From Matt... Karis, thank you. I'm just confused because there's no wig or anything in here. <laughs> ah, we got a huge box of ramen. Holy shit. We have so much ramen, like I don't even know how to do all this stuff. Oh, I get it. What? Because you always say uh, his hair looks like ramen. Oh, okay. I think that's what they meant by that. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, shit. We got more knives. <laughs> Folding pocket comb. That's awesome. There we go. So this is the lock. Take this off. That is so cool. That is so cool. Wow. I want. I don't want to open this wrong. That's oh beautiful. my gosh. That's beautiful. That is so sweet, bro. It's like a dagger. Hi, Lance. The rainbow knife is for Lizzie, and the sword-looking one, and the comb are for you. Say hi to everyone for me. Keep up the good work from Patrick. So I'm assuming there was another knife somewhere, but I don't think we got it yet. Oh, another knife. Double turbo. This is crazy looking. It kind of looks like the other one a little bit that we just took out. What? <laughs> what? That is Dude, so it looks like a scorpion. That is so sick. Thank you. Let's try to. <laughs> there we go. Hi, Lance. This is for Lizzie, and I also sent you a case for extra battery life. And by the way, you're like the only vlogger I watch on YouTube. And I love your videos, and I wish I get to see you one day, which I probably won't. Maybe. Never know. Maybe I'll go on tour or something and I'll have a meet and greet. I'm guessing this is another knife. Oh, Batman knife. Ooh. Yo. Oh. What the oh. hell? Frank was just saying something about this. How do you open this, Frank? Oh, here it is. Like that. Wow. And the other one comes out the other end. What that the hell? Beautiful. Thank you. That's so cool. Now don't hurt yourself, Lizzie. Yeah. Oh my God, another oh knife. My gosh. Is that all you got to? <laughs> oh, this one's nice. This is kind of like my other one. That's so sweet. I like that. Thank you. A gift from Patrick Canarga. So yeah, this is actually Lizzie's knife. Here Thank you go, Lizzie. You. The mug that won't fall over. Mighty mug. Oh, I've actually seen something like this before. That's pretty cool. It kind of sticks down to your table and you can push it and it won't fall. Hi Lance, this cup is for Lizzie and it is cool because if you put it on a surface, it's really hard to knock over. Love your videos and congrats to 1 million subscribers. Archie Butler. Thank you, Archie. Here you go, Lizzie. Thank you. This is so cool. Does it make really make a difference? It's because now she can't add her commentary. No. Which is annoying half the time anyway. I can tell that it annoys you. Yeah. Because like I'll sit there and like and then I'll cut it anyway. Alright. Bunch of bubble wrap. Oh my gosh! Carnival funnel cake mix. This is perfect. Thank you. Oh my god. We're gonna make some bomb ass funnel cakes today, guys. This is from Neil Kelly. Thank you so much, Neil. No way. Is it more funnel cake? I think it's more funnel cake. Original funnel cake mix oh. with another thing. Oh 
Thank you. Oh my gosh, these are gonna be amazing. I don't think you I understand. I'm so hyped right now. I don't think you guys understand how happy Lance is right now. I am so <laughs> fucking happy. And I'm even more happy because we spent like the entire day the other day trying to get a fucking funnel cake mix. Another one! <laughs> Carnival funnel cakes. That is awesome. Includes original and apple cinnamon mix. That seems pretty uh, interesting. Definitely gotta try that. Oh my gosh, it's a money float. And why does this look like Frank? <laughs> Doesn't funny. it, Frank? Yeah, that that's is fun. so that's funny. Up. Dude, that is so cool. This is actually another float from Simon Klein. Thank you, Simon. Like, hi, Lance. I know you're probably getting sick of all the pool toys, but here's one more. I know basically what you like, but please tell me if there's anything in specific you want. You guys don't have to send over anything if you don't want to. Like, I'm not asking for anything. I just leave my P.O. box open in case you guys want to stuff. And obviously, you guys like when I open your stuff on camera. And I, I appreciate every single thing you guys send to me. Um, but yeah, like I'm not asking for anything, but thank you, man. This package is from Hassan's Dominic, and this is Sour Smog Balls, but they're actually from Toxic Waste, the same company that makes those, I guess. So I gotta try these out as well. So much funnel cake, I'm so hype. Are you guys hype? We're gonna make it later? Very. After we go to the gym, yeah, for sure. What are you thinking of Money Float? I'm rich. Look, does it, you're rich, yeah? I'm rich. <laughs> because of that. Doesn't it look like Frank? Yeah. <laughs> Trying out Lizzie's cup right now. So basically it's just like suction cups, I'm pretty sure. And then... <laughs> hey! I mean, if you punch it hard enough, it's gonna come off. I don't think anybody does that, though. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've seen like people test videos like that, but it's cool. My dad's filling up the float. Grandmom said even Nina can fit on that. <laughs> said even you and Nina. <laughs> <laughs> what are you choking on, girl? Because he lies. Huh? <laughs> what, choking? <laughs> no, lying. <laughs> I said, that float's big enough for me. Yeah. <laughs> Two of you. Come here, you got a piece of blonde hair. Where? Blonde hair. It's oh. Cry, Lizzie's. Well, who else would it be? They Yours. Lie. About to take our pre workout. Frank's yeah. taking some today. Right. Who put water in mine? I don't. Somebody spit in it. No. I swear to God, no. I didn't even touch it. No one touched it, Lance. You probably started filling it with water. Playing a prank on me. Hey. How is it? Good. <laughs> when you think it's just a normal cop, walk by. It came. Oh shit! <laughs> that was a fail. It came up that time. Fuck. <laughs> Grandma, what are you doing? Let's go. You gotta yeah, go to the gym. Go ahead, Mom. I'll see you in ten minutes. Start without me. Start without you. Gotta take your pre-workout, Graham. Uh, it's already in my glass. Oh, it is. Where's your glass? Yeah, right there. Right where? Badass, Grandma. Yeah. They ain't pre-workout in here. This is warm. So I haven't hit triceps yet. So that's what I'm gonna be doing today. You ready? Yeah. Ah. All right, let's go back inside. <laughs> I'm kidding. We're going to the gym now. So Frank shaved his armpits, show him, and it's slowly growing back and now it's irritated as fuck, isn't it? Now it feels better now. Two days ago it was irritated. Yeah, because like the, the hair starts coming in, it's all prickly. Yeah, I don't get why, like how girls can deal with that, so props to you guys. Yeah, well I mean they, they're like constantly shaving it every day. Yeah, but it's so hard to get the razor in, like because mine's such a divot, like it was difficult. <laughs> I'm never doing it again. Yeah. See, I'll trim my armpit hair every once in a while. I won't shave that shit fully. Though. Yeah, that's what I usually do, but I was like, you know what, screw okay. it. I got a fresh razor, why not try it? Yeah. <laughs> Me and Frank hit chest so hard the other day. It was a couple days ago, dude, and I'm still sore. Wednesday, today's Saturday. Just wrapped up that workout. I feel really good today. Accomplished with that workout. I'm sweating like a pig, which I love. Now it's time for a nap. <laughs> a nap. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, there's so many birds. Frank is sitting here getting Gio to lick his abs for him. No, I told him to stop. He, he likes so why did you just take your shirt off? You were flexing like that as he was licking you. Come on. 
<laughs> oh my god, Frank, that was the most amazing story ever. Mom, did you hear that story? We're fucking with Frank right now. He just he just told us like the most boring story ever. <laughs> and we all fucking started roasting him. Frank, that story was back to sleep. Fuck all of you. <laughs> Oh my god, my dad is so fucking mad today. I don't understand why. I just shot him with the nerf guns. He usually gets me what? <laughs> He's throwing fucking suitcases at me. <laughs> Are they is there stuff in here? They're empty. <laughs> Lance, where are you going? Fucking leaving. With no shoes on? Shit. <laughs> I'm almost 100% sure my dad's kidding around, but that's pretty funny that he actually threw suitcases at me like that. We're all hungry right now, and I was just talking about different foods that we could get. Like, we could either go to Walmart and pick up some chicken and make some chicken here, or we can go to Arby's and get those sliders, because I had them a couple days ago, and honestly, it was really good. And Frank was like, yeah, let's go there. They looked really good. So that's what we're going to do. It looks like Frank's a fucking air freshener dealer. I'll show you. Look how many he's got. Why do you have so many? I just never get rid of them. Gio, what are you barking at? Sing. Just got here. Let's see what I want. No idea. Lizzie got a slider and I got one. And I also got a turkey club and some fries. Do you have enough sauces, dude? Bro, I got some for everybody. We already have ketchup. I'm not even <laughs> using it, too. <laughs> Frank just got all sliders and curly fries. They look good, too. Yeah. Just wrapped up eating. It was pretty good. What did you think of your sliders? They were delicious. You should try the buffalo one. The it buffalo really one? Good. Yeah, I don't really they like buffalo chicken that much though. It was good. Just like plain old chicken. Frank, he's <laughs> burping so fucking loud, dude. How do you keep doing that shit? It's from soda. I, that's why I hate drinking soda. Oh my god. Like, yeah, I can't even tell you guys how fucking loud it is. Like, remember when I gave him that fart shit? It's louder than that. I don't even know how. Dude, I don't understand why it's called fart powder. It should be called gas powder, because I didn't fart once. Yeah, you were just burping the whole day. <laughs> Oh, uh, that wasn't as good. He tapped my shoulder <laughs> to like fucking record real quick. I held it in too long. Yeah. Fuck! He just had a loud one. It was probably the loudest one the yet. The longest one. And I fucking missed it. Man, I can never what get it. I know. What is this from? Me and my dad pulling out our cars. Frank's bringing out the airsoft guns. We're about to shoot some shit. You got your sniper? Yep. I see you tried coloring in the tip up here. Yeah, I just spray painted it. Low key illegal. But you can still see the orange a little bit, so you're good. I didn't like spray paint the very tip of it, right? It, no, you're good. Everyone's blowing up some balloons right now. We're gonna prop these up on the gate, probably tape them to it, and then we're gonna do some target practice. Grandmom's even gonna be shooting today. You excited? Thrilled to death. <laughs> I think we got plenty of balloons. They're all getting set up right now. Frank has a bunch of his hands, too. <laughs> <laughs> she got so scared. <laughs> what? It didn't even pop it. What? What's your problem? I was hitting it. <laughs> Dad <laughs> wants to try it. Oh. Wow! Oh. Right. Grandma. Stop! You why did you make me hit it? You scared me. Okay. You tipped it. You heard it. Hold on. It popped. <laughs> It went inside of it. It didn't go all the way through. What the hell? It's deflating. That's funny as hell. Okay, it hit it. Oh, did you see that? What? It, it dude. It ricocheted? Yeah. yeah. Look at it that. It came all the way back here? It yeah. came the all the way happen? back. It did come all the way back. It did. And it hit me in the leg. I saw it. Where's where I'm looking? Ah, <laughs> fuck me. She gonna see you down. Because I'm down at the bottom. I gotta get up to see the balloons. You fuck her. Go ahead. I knew I wasn't gonna hit nothing. <laughs> because the balloons were over there and I'm pointing this way. That shit just ricocheted and almost hit grandma from all the way over there. <laughs> Say it, grandma. <laughs> so we're skipping through a few hours right now. I wanted to make that funnel cake 
and me and Frack are gonna head to the store really quick because I realized that we still don't have oil. So I'm gonna pick some of that up and then we're gonna make these funnel cakes. I was about to leave to go get oil, but Sabrina had Geo and I guess he went to go for a walk really quick, so I'm taking him out. Just got our oil. Let's get home and make these funnel cakes. I'm pretty hype. I hope they taste really good. Okay, so I just put some oil inside of the funnel cake maker. I'm about to use this one. We're gonna make it right now and then we're gonna start pouring them in there. So this is the patter it came with. Just gotta add water and stir it and then we should be good to go. All right, let's start making it. Oh, it's coming out slow. This makes them real thick, which I mean, I don't mind, but it's kind of hard to, uh... okay. Let's just see how this one turns out. <laughs> Look, it's making a mess. It's driven out the top and shit. First funnel cake done. Unfortunately, while we were at Walgreens, we didn't realize that we had like no sugar. We only have, we only have a little bit, so somebody has to run to the store and grab it. <laughs> There's not a lot in there. So our first funnel cake is done, and Frank actually offered to go get the uh, confectionate sugar from the store. These cook fast. Yeah. Just made four total funnel cakes. I'm just waiting on Frank to get back with the sugar, and then we'll be eating them. All right, we got our sugar now. Frank just got back. Thank you for that, boy. No problem. Now, how was that shit? Yo, that's like the best funnel cake I ever had. No way. Yeah. Have you ever gotten a funnel cake from across the street? No. Dude, that's like amazing. So if this is better than that, I'll be surprised. Do you like it, or? <laughs> I've been sitting here staring at this thing for like the past 30 minutes until Frank got back, so It's good, but it's not as good as the other place. So we just wrapped up eating the funnel cakes They were pretty freaking good. I gotta admit they were definitely a little bit better than the last batch that we made Which was like a month or two ago, but right now I think we're all just gonna chill for the rest of the night They wanted to go into the jacuzzi, so that's what we're gonna do right now But honestly after that I think I might just end up passing out so I think I'm just gonna end my vlog here so if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to smash that thumbs up button. I'd really appreciate it. Don't forget to turn on my post notifications so you never miss a new video. And I will see you guys next time. Do you want me to stop? Oh, Keep going. Stop, no, 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 stop. Okay. Hold on, hold on.